New Year's resolutions include getting more fit and living a healthier lifestyle, of course. If shedding pounds is making its way onto your resolution list, WSLS 10's Bethany Teague shows us some initiatives localities are offering to help with that. January 1st is right around the corner, and for many people, that means more trips to the gym. But often, the new push to get fit quickly times out. We know resolutions often aren't kept or met. We fall off by the wayside very quickly. So how do good intentions go from being a passing fad to a permanent lifestyle? CrossFit Blacksburg owner Carol Bellevue says set goals and have someone else keep you accountable. I can't emphasize enough that it's, it's really good to have a plan no matter what time of year it is. In Pulaski, town employees are doing just that. Starting in January, they are launching a Biggest Loser competition with the hope that all residents will follow their lead. We hear so much more about obesity, especially within our youth. And so if our staff is putting forth that effort and promoting that through emails and our town council is recognizing it, we're putting on Facebook what our staff's doing and how we're participating, um, it's a great way to show that leadership. With County, we'll begin offering open gym hours for basketball and walking through the spring. Bellevue says this commitment to overall health is the only way to succeed with health and fitness goals long term. What we started to see was it wasn't just coming in the gym and knocking out whatever movements. It was a full, well-rounded wellness solution. The Wythe County Parks and Rec Department will also provide several fitness classes to anyone for a reduced price to keep people active through the winter. In Blacksburg, Bethany T, WSLS 10.